Hi, we're going to assess the difference between a true leg length and an apparent leg length discrepancy today. Our patient, we lay them supine, we get their legs uh, out straight. I'm going to take a hold of her legs and I'm going to gently pull. Okay, I'm going to pull down just like this and this will just even out any differences or any, any pelvic obliquity. Now I'm looking straight down at the malleoli and I'm going to put my thumbs up underneath the two bones and I'm just going to see are they even or not. You can visually assess the malleoli and you can see that they're pretty even and you can put your thumbs up there too and assess that difference and I'll let you bring the camera around. Okay, now I'm going to come up here and assist the patient and I will help her come up into the long sitting position. Okay, and then I'll come right back around and I'll just come around here and we'll do the same thing a little gentle traction, okay, and use my thumbs, put them under the malleoli, plus I'll visually inspect. I might even dorsiflex a bit and just try to, if you want to bring the camera around here, we can look at the heels of the feet and just make sure that we're getting a, maybe we can bring the camera up right on top of that, okay. But as you can see, Hopefully the camera is picking up the evenness of the legs in both the long sitting, let's lay her back supine, and supine position. From these two different positions, we get what look like uh, no difference in the leg length. I'm going to flex her up. What we see in this position, however, what looks like a long femur uh, or I should say a short femur on the left. And this has been um, detected radiographically with a full body x-ray um, and we do have that that does show that this left femur is indeed just short compared to the right. Now if we can have you stand up please. I'll have you come around here and face the wall. Okay. <clears throat> So in standing, we notice there's a little bit of left iliac is a little bit lower than the right. Okay, the left gluteal fold is lower than the right. And you do wear a heel lift on the left side. Mm -hmm. so what we have here is a true leg length difference. The left side is the short side. Uh, the testing shows that the uh, legs are uh, the same in, in the two tested positions. Uh, and so that would mean the patient has a true leg length difference.